back. Uh, recent concerns over business ethics and social responsibility moving a local businessman to create a center to research the issue. And over the weekend, it was announced that Marion University was selected to house the new center. Joining us now is Frank Walker from Walker Research and the president of Marion Research University, table. Daniel Elsner. Good to see you both. Good to see you. My pleasure. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. Mr. Walker, tell us uh, about the idea behind this. How was it born? The idea started with my parents teaching me to be ethical. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably a good thing, right? <laughs> so it goes from there. <clears throat> and uh, I was uh, uh, blessed to uh, be the son of the founder of Walker. Mm -hmm. I went into business, and uh, in marketing, um, you have to differentiate yourself. Right. So to me, the ultimate in differentiation is after you build a good product, you advertise it, you market it, and so forth, you have to differentiate. And I thought it was much like humans in the Maslow theory. Sure. Self-realization, a company that could say, we are tops in social responsibility, mm -hmm. our responsibility to people, is a differenti differentiation that attracts customers. Sure, makes sense. So you research that, and then you find out. In fact, employees want to work harder and longer for companies that are ethical. Customers want to keep coming back to you. Mm -hmm. So it's not only the right thing to do, it's, it's good business. Chick-fil-A, I think, is the perfect example of that. Excellent example. Right? Excellent. Where does Marion University come into play, and how did this all come about? Well, Frank and I have been friends for a lot of years, and about a year ago, actually, we started a conversation. Frank's a thorough person. He's not a donor. He's an investor, I say. Right. <laughs> and he did some thorough research of various universities that would make, be, this would be part of their DNA, that we would make it part of our mission and values for our students, but also reaching out to advance the common good. Successful businesses that endure over decades are ethical businesses. Mm -hmm. They keep their reputation. It's good for employment. It's good for the fabric of society. So Marion, uh, as you see, as a Catholic university, has an interest in our students graduating as leaders that are ethical. And we have a in, in, big interest in advancing the common good. Universities should be part of that and to partner with Frank and his dream of bringing ethics up to the top um, was just a match made in heaven, I hope. <laughs> I, I, actually, I'm very confident of it, so we're very thankful. Uh, about 30 seconds left. How are students going to benefit from this? Students are going to benefit because it'll enhance the depth, the ethics we already require, but also to be involved in research in the community and professors and to be part of a university that's branded around ethics, a differentiator. I think Frank said it well. That's what we're about. Well, gentlemen, fantastic. Mr. Walker, good to meet you, sir. Thank, thank you. you very much. Thank you for all you do. Thank you. Nice well, to really meet you good. both. Yeah, thank you for so. taking some time for us uh, this afternoon, and good luck. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you very much. We're glad to be here. All right. Randy Aulis, what do you have for us today, sir? Well,